Well, we are just a few days into the second half of the 2019 le legislative session, and already dozens of bills are dead. As State House Bureau Chief David Williams reports, some of the bills had a lot of people talking. It looks like Indiana's time zones will stay the same for now. A bill that would have moved our whole state to the central time zone is technically dead. I'm from Chicago, so that works for me. I, I think we should be more on the eastern. I'd rather have a central, but I'll take eastern. <laughs> it's clear the clock will keep ticking on this debate. Another controversial proposal not moving on, making Indiana's undocumented immigrant students eligible for in-state tuition. From the way I look at it, yes, they should. State Rep. Earl Harris's bill didn't get a hearing in the Education Committee. So it wasn't just an open free-for-all. Uh, they would have to graduate or get a GED from an Indiana high school, attended high school in Indiana at least three years, and also if they weren't in the process of becoming a citizen, file an affidavit, affidavit that they will work on becoming an American citizen. Harris says it's possible his proposal could be added to another bill this session, but I don't have a lot of confidence we're going to have that happen this session, but believe me, we will continue to work on this. Smokers can snub out the idea of paying more in cigarette taxes. State Rep. Cindy Kirkhoffer's bill would have raised the cigarette tax by $2 per pack. A tax would perhaps, or perhaps dissuade individuals from smoking and having healthy pregnancies, number one, and just overall health of Hoosiers is uh, the most important aspect of the bill. I'm in public health. Okay. So uh, I, I'm, I'm upset that that didn't happen. Kirk offers hopeful that a Senate committee can save the bill when tobacco tax talks come up. Many more bills are dead this session. I'll put a link to the complete list on our website. Just go to wishtv.com and click on this story. In the State House, I'm David Williams, Wish TV News 8.